Hey everyone, welcome back to another CGH video. And in this video, we're gonna be doing something we haven't done in a long time. It's been well over a year since I've made one of these videos, and it's by far one of the most requested things I've ever seen in the comments. So today, I'm gonna show you guys some very cool military outfits that you can make in GTA Online. As always, these are just some ideas. You can always alter them any way you please. So don't get mad at me if they don't look a certain way you want them to. Now let's not waste any time and let's get right into it. So started things off, we have a gray urban style military outfit. In order to make this, you're gonna need the gray digital camo pants, the silver tactical boots, the gray digital sport biker jacket, the gray digital armored gloves, the gray scarf, the crosshatch quad lens combat helmet, the gray scale urban ski sports glasses, the forest combat shoot bag, and then go ahead and save what you have. So after that, equip the gray digital ski mask inside of your apartment building to do the telescope glitch. All you have to do is run at the telescope at a certain direction while pressing your right D-pad. Kinda wanna like go off to the left or off to the right really fast, so you should move towards the telescope without actually looking through it. From here, you can go ahead and change to the outfit you saved in the clothing store and then just walk away and the mask you had on before doing the glitch should appear along with your helmet and goggles. All you have to do then is save it. This next outfit is something you've seen in my videos previously and it's one of the most requested ones and I never really shared how to make it, so here we go. So first you're gonna need the gray digital camo pants, the desert tactical boots, the khaki t-shirt, gray fingerless gloves, the carbon chronos submariner watch, the tan desert scarf, and the salmon plate carrier. Now you want to make sure you do that in order. You want to equip the scarf, then the vest. If you equip the vest, then the scarf, it won't work. And then an optional choice is to put a crew logo on the back, aka put a CGH one on there because the crew is now open for you to join. Next, you want to use the same helmet as the last one, the crosshatch, quad lens, whatever combat helmet, the grayscale urban ski goggles, and then save what you have. Then we're going to do the same sort of telescope glitch that we did last time, but this time we're going to be using a half mask. So go ahead and equip that. Then just run at the telescope when you have the helmet and the half mask on and you should glitch. Once you're in this screen, all you have to do this time is just switch to those gray goggles that we had before. Then just walk away and you should have the glasses, helmet and half mask all at the same time. This one's a little bit different, a little bit different with the method, but it still works the same way. Then just go ahead and save it. This next one is nothing too special, but I just really like the way this one looked. So in order to do this one, we're gonna be doing the same sort of telescope glitch as well at the end. But first you wanna get the Flectarn cargo pants, the charcoal tactical boots, the charcoal combat sweater, the black tactical gloves, the black desert scarf, and then the black plate carrier vest. You wanna make sure you get the scarf and then the vest, not the other way around. Then get the charcoal low beanie and save what you have so far. Then you wanna do the same thing that we did last time, equipped a rebreather this time, however, and run at the telescope. And once you are glitched, you wanna go ahead and switch to the outfit you saved at the clothing store. So this should be the outfit with the beanie. And you should notice that you have the beanie and the rebreather on. Now you do not wanna save this in your apartment. If you try to save it upstairs, your rebreather will come off. So you wanna run all the way to the clothing store and save it there because the rebreather will still be on your outfit as opposed to not having it saved at your apartment. So if you wanted to switch to this outfit with your interaction menu, you're gonna to have to select the outfit twice. So the first time you select this outfit, you will notice it will not have the rebreather on. But if you click X again, it will appear on your character. So pretty much just double tap X when you select this outfit. So this next one is pretty cool because it uses the CEO bodyguard outfit glitch along with the telescope glitch. So first you're gonna need to be a bodyguard of a friend's CEO or whatever. Then you're gonna wanna tell him to switch to this outfit type. Then you wanna go into your apartment, go into your shower and you're gonna wanna communicate with him. You wanna tell him to retire as soon as you enter the shower. And your end result should be a CEO bodyguard outfit while he is retired as a CEO, therefore you can now save this. So now that you have the outfit saved, you can go ahead and customize it. You can put a Fleck Tarn Quad Lens Combat Helmet, the Grayscale Urban Ski Goggles, then you can save it once you have all that, and then you can equip the Fleck Tarn Ski Mask and do the telescope glitch by running at the telescope, pressing right D-pad, and then switching to the outfit you saved at the clothing store. Then just walk away from the telescope and you should have the glasses, helmet, and mask all on at the same time 
using the bodyguard outfit glitch as well as the telescope one. So this next one involves no glitches whatsoever. It's just a pretty cool military outfit that I thought I'd throw in here. So this next one, you're going to need the brown digital camo pants, the charcoal tactical boots, the brown digital sports biker jacket, the black combat shoot bag, the black woolen gloves, the black scarf, the brown digital tactical ski mask, and the brown digital quad lens combat helmet. Then you can save it and that's the outfit. Very simple, no glitches required. So that's gonna do it for this video guys. If you guys did enjoy this video, be sure to leave a like on it and subscribe for more. If you guys would like to see more of these videos, be sure to leave it down in the comments and leave a like. It'll tell me that you guys enjoyed it and wanna see more. I'm sorry about my voice, it's pretty much gone. I've been playing PUBG all day, I've been yelling, so it's not in the best shape. However, thank you guys so much for watching and for everything gaming, you know where to find it right here at CGH.